Hello, I'm Chris Menard. I was asked in Microsoft Teams to explain how do you invite people to a meeting outside your company or outside your organization. Really easy to do. I already have Teams running. I'm already signed in. Over on the left navigation panel, you always have activity and chat and Teams. I'm going to come down here to more added apps and go ahead and click on the calendar. I always want to see my calendar, so I want to point out right now it's in italics, so here's a quick tip. Right click it, and now it is no longer in italics, so it's always here. Today is the 20, uh, 22nd. I should know what today is. Let me go down and make a calendar meeting for 6 p.m. I'm going to left click one time. That changes the screen. This is going to be an accounts receivable meeting for April. I'm making up that name. Here you go. Add required attendees. This is for people outside your organization. I'm going to put in a Gmail address that I have. Notice it says invite Christopher Menard 9 at Gmail. It doesn't have to be a Gmail. It works with Gmail, Yahoo, other company domain names. You could come in here and put in optional people. If I click on optional, same thing would apply. Just showing you that. I'm not changing the date or the time. Add channel. This video is technically not about this, but I need to explain it. This is for people if you want to post this to a channel. So this is an accounts receivable meeting up at the top in the title. So I may post this to the finance team, the accounts receivable channel. Anyone that's in the finance team, obviously they're going to members, they're going to be members of that channel. This will post on that channel. So I'll show you that too. But more importantly, I'm going to go show you what it looks like when you invite someone outside the organization right up here. I'm good here. I'm not going to any more details, but there's send already have that Gmail address running. So let me show you what that looks like. I got a, have an email from finance AR meeting for April. That was the title. So be specific about that Has a little RSVP over here. Totally up to the person you invited where they hit yes, no, or maybe I'm going to hit yes. That will put it on my Google calendar since I'm in Gmail. But more importantly, down below, join Microsoft Teams meeting. Just to show you what this looks like when it's time to start this meeting. So I, I could hit yes here. That does put it on my calendar. I can always join the meeting from here, but I could also join it from my calendar. To show you what this looks like, this is such a cool feature. I'm going to go and sign out of Teams. So it pops up, it wants me to put in the name, I'm going to put in, um, I make it up a name to let you know that I'm the guest. Uh, you can choose whether the video is on or off, I'm recording, so I've got my camera already on, but I'll turn my camera on, audio, I'll just leave them both off for now. I'm going to hit join now. When I hit join now, Microsoft Teams, because I'm not a member of this organization, is going to put me in the lobby. There you go. Someone is in. Someone in the meeting will let you in soon. This is called the lobby. Uh, I, as the host, would be signed in. I would get notified that someone is in the lobby, and I can just admit them, which is another cool feature. So you only have people in your meetings that you want in your meetings. Anyway, that is how you invite people outside your company. Feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Have a great day. Thank you.